My name is Lucas Hütiger. I'm running DPX Fine Chemicals. I'm part of the Pathion team, so we are under one umbrella. We're branding all pharma activities under Pathion and use DPX Fine Chemicals for our agro and intermediate business. I'm already more than 20 years in this industry. I have seen a lot and I think it's now time that we rethink our position and see how we want to move forward. You all use smartphones, tablets, laptops. You're very intimate in contact with electronics and uh, I think if you look at the electronics history you see a very very strong case why we should move on and have a look at the integration of uh, value chains, supply chains. When you look back in the 1970s, the original equipment manufacturers, they had everything under one roof. Had the same issues as some of us have, as some of our customers have with capacity management, either they have too much or too little, or their own capacity available. During the 1980s and 90s, the first more open models came across, people started to outsource, people started only to focus on some activities, and then in the 2000s, you actually saw fully outsourced supply chains where key uh, companies like IBM, Siemens, Cisco, or you can take Apple as a model as well, where they actually did the design, the branding, the marketing, the sales at the end channels, but everything else was done outside. In parallel, what you then see is, you have companies like Electronics, Founded uh, very early on in the 80s, started small, started with small activities and then really extended their scope, delivering today completely integrated supply chain solutions, horizontally and vertically integrated and really delivering a massive value to the industry. And we strongly believe that we can actually change this as well and can have a look at such a model and take the analogy over to our pharma um, supply chain. There are a lot of parallels, but there's a clear disclaimer. You know, we are working in a very highly regulated field. This field takes a certain inflexibility into account and we have to cater for this. But there's a lot of learnings we still can take out. One is the speed to market. You see in electronics, you do this once or twice a year, you try to launch a new phone. We also have, uh, we need the speed, especially to bring early phase, preclinical, phase one, phase two, as fast to the market as possible. So here, focus on the time to reduce, the time that we have to take to, uh, to get to clinics. Simplified event management is a very, very good learning we take out of this. We, at the moment, some of us do more than other suppliers to the farm industry. Some of us just do a specific technology Others have already now drug product, drug substance in their own hands, so we can actually extend our, our service the way how we do a deal with it. We can rapidly build new services if we go into further analytics, supply chain management, vendor management, so I think there we can fast expand our uh, scope of actions. We all know how important quality is, so I will come back to this later. I think outstanding execution is a real key part that we have to do. Electronics, they do this as well. You see now with the new Apple phone launch, how little tweaks, you know, immediately are in big news and have a big impact on the sales. Here, you know, for us, quality is the absolute, the foundation, how, do we, how we move on. And then we can actually move quickly across segments like you can do this in the, in the electronics world as well. You all have seen market data. Some of you have been in industry for many years as well. We have already seen some consolidation in the market. We've seen, especially the last couple of years, a real shift in our you know, major customers. 15, 20 years ago, when you talked about early phase work, the major part of this work was in the hand of the top 20, top 50 pharma companies. When you look here at the graph, you see that a lot of smaller and mid-sized companies now really own the maturity of the pipeline. And Impressive, phase one, phase two is clear, but even in phase three. So this means our market, our customer segment has segmented. On the other hand, we have now to see that we can actually deliver tailor-made services to these smaller customers which have no the big backbone. 
from that point of view, I think it's now time to change the model how we work, the way how we integrate ourselves and really cater for these highly innovative companies, try to reduce, uh, to increase their speed, how they can bring new products into the clinical phases or at the end to the markets. There are a lot of quotes out already. Him as Jamila's quote from Farm Source, I think we need a different model to guarantee a different speed to move forward. During the integration of uh, DSM pharmaceutical products and Pathion, we did customer interviews. We tested the field. We tried really to gauge what is important. And we got three very, very important slogans out of a lot of different interviews. Speeding up drug development is absolutely key. I think this brings, for smaller companies, the revenues early, possible merger or the possible divestiture or outlicensing uh, faster to the, to, the, uh, to the place. Vendor management for a lot of mid-sized and smaller companies is very complex, just from the legal side, from uh, managing three or four different suppliers. I think here, you know, we can bring a lot of uh, additional services to the field. Cost of good savings, some people, for them it's important. For us, when we actually analyze it, we can actually add much more value to a transaction than just to deliver kilograms or amples or tablets. And I think cost of good is not the key. I think speed, simplicity, and expertise is much more important. That's the, where, the area that we want to focus on. Based on this, we created our new offering to the industry. We're launching this year, uh, this week, our Pathion One Source end-to-end -end development solution, where we try really to bundle up early phase drug substance development production with early phase formulation drug product uh, development, and we deliver expertise here to bring this from early phase as fast as possible into full manufacturing. We all know, and a lot of our colleagues have already tried this out. It's a very complex way forward. And to pay respect to the complexity of the issue, we split the whole process in two phases. We start with a phase one, where we try now to simplify phase one clinical development up to phase two. Here, we will focus mainly on speed to get you as a customer earlier to the clinical phases. We do parallel processing between API synthesis and drug development. We have a really good network to get this done. We try to focus on simplicity, and this will start with simple issues like to have a single point of contact or a single contract and then statements of work, add-ons, so that we don't spend too much time with legal folks and really focus on the clinical uh, demands that the product has. And here we bring, as Pathion, uh, the expertise to the table as a full-scale manufacturer on drop, on drop product and also on drug substance. For us, it's very important that we really hand down to the early phase customers this uh, expertise. We will focus on the wave two early next year, where we will propose how we move forward with the whole supply chain management, also with the IT connections that we want to have, how we can bring value there with networking capital management. This part we work internally out at the moment, and we will launch this at DCAT next year. There will also be a big question, especially from our customer side, how can we support this? And for us, it's very, very important that, that we simplify. One point of contact, I think this is the most important part, that one, of, uh, one member of our team really has all the access to all the key people in our shop, but also has a good access to the, the key people on our customer side. I think that's for us the most important part, a single point of contact that we clearly define the interfaces so we can really simply manage this and we don't create a big machine around it so we can really attack the issues, resolve the issues together and move forward very, very fast. I already mentioned speed a couple of times. For us, speed is the most important part here. It is very important that we get your speed to move further in the faster in the clinics. We did our own studies internally. We looked at projects uh, between fill finish and between active developments, if it's biologics or on the chemical side, and we see that we can carve out between two to four months development time. Base here is that we do parallel processing, parallel development, we share in QC methods, we share a lot of uh, project management uh, tools, 
and try to do this very, very lean. I think that's a good way forward. That's our target to show you that we can do that, deliver this. The one source values, I think they're clear. We try to keep them simple as well. Speed, as I already mentioned, the most important for us. Seamless integration in one team should deliver a much easier interface to you. Sharing know-how in a, in, a, in a homogeneous team speeds everything up. The parallel development between drug substance and drug product will really be a step ahead. We can address polymorph issues very early on. We can address milling issues very early on, formulation problems and challenges. And then the closer we get to phase three, the seamless integration of the supply chain really delivers their help as well, will create speed. On the other hand, you know, simplicity is for us and for you very important as a customer. To file a new application is very time consuming, it's complex, and the more simplicity we can bring to the table, I think it's important. Legal contract management for us is very important that we integrate the whole supply and management and logistics in our own hands so you don't have to deal with this, it makes life easier for you. We will have a very clear IP management approach so we don't have to deal with two or three different IP policies and then on the contractual side we deal with liability in a completely different way, uh, way that we do this at the moment as well. The second for us as important part of speed and simplicity is expertise. As already mentioned, uh, as Pathion, as CPX Fine Chemicals, we bring you full-scale know-how to the table. And this full-scale production know-how has a lot of already expertise in, experience for many hundreds of tech transfers, many hundreds of uh, method transfers, or analytical trans uh, method transfers, scale-ups. We all had to deal with a lot of issues in the past, and I think this expertise the customers get in early phase as a built-in value on top of whatever we do on the speed and simplicity part. With this, we can leverage our know-how, our customers can leverage the know-how that we have on large scale and bring this into early phase. We create additional value for those uh, who want to out-license, because who, to whoever you show the results what we will develop in the future, you see that this was done from a really, from a partner with a lot of expertise with a good track record on quality, a good track record on manufacturing. That's for us uh, the added value that we bring to this part. As I mentioned at the beginning, I think it's time that we transform the industry. We at Parfion strongly believe that we have to support our patients. I think that's the end goal from all of us involved in this industry. There are a lot of unmet needs still out there. And I think you have to see that we can speed up the development cycles, we can add additional value so that at the end we get really the best pharmaceuticals out of the market as fast as possible. And for this, I think we have to evolve the model. The unmet needs, I think they're there, they're clearly there. There's an ongoing discussion on healthcare costs as well. From that point of view, I think it's our role and our obligation to really to change the model, the way how we deal between the CDMO area and the pharma, our pharma customers, to really to speed up, create additional value, bring drug products faster to the, uh, into the clinics, produce them on a more efficient level and uh, better pricing at the end for the end market. We see that as an integrated offering from a CDMO space, we can really focus on quality, service and flexibility. If we do this integrated, we can deliver more quality faster speed, the expertise to the end market, and I think both sides have uh, a simplification here. On the one hand, we simplify the supply chains. On the other hand, our customers get additional value integrated into the actual product and the, pro uh, the process development. In addition, as I already mentioned, we uh, generate additional value for our smaller pharma companies. If they want to out-license a product, if we do this as a company with a long track record with expertise, we really develop very, very solid packages that will create a better value that you can actually claim from a larger pharma company with a very solid supply chain that you're already selling out license with your product than what uh, a lot of maybe smaller companies can do. Therefore, you know, we come to the conclusion internally that, you know, to go out to a one source offering in this industry is a vital part of our strategy to move forward. We strongly believe that the industry is ready for this and we can create a lot of additional value. 
with our initiative, we try to expand the value that we deliver to the farm industry, that we enable the transformation to change the model that the, how the farm industry is working stepwise and really go to a combined uh, business model. So for us, to answer the question that was on slide one, you know, for us this is not just a boss and marketing slogan. I think we really see this as a value to trans that transform the industry stepwise. And as I mentioned, we start ourselves with uh, our services for phase one and phase two clinical development. This was in short for us uh, the launch of our one source program. We are very excited that we moved so fast in this field after the integration of DSM pharmaceutical products and Pathion. And uh, we are here, a couple of my colleagues are here as well if you have any questions to our program. Many thanks.